Hello, um, I'm doing control now. Uh, I'm still gonna do Greedfall. I'm just gonna do them uh, back and forth like I did before with stuff like Arkham City and Maneater. Um, what's it called? It's been a, a weird past few days. I wasn't able to record anything because power had gone out. It's super weird. I don't know. I'm pretty sure other people like in the entire city have lost power in the entire state. And it's super weird. Um, it's just strange. Anyway, I'm going to do control, which I'm really pumped for. I'm going into this blind, like with Great Fall. I don't know. I usually know a lot about the games and basically know how to play them. But now that I'm recording games again, I'm just going back into them blind. Also, these are games that I don't know about. Like with Maneater, that was the only game I went into blind. Okay, anyway new game uh, I want my brightness to be maximum uh, I'm wearing headphones but I wanna go wait I'm gonna wear headphones for this um, text language yeah English I mean audio language subtitles yes start new game I'm pretty sure all I know about this game is that you got su that you have superpowers and some and I'm pretty sure a lot of people like it. Oh no, is it gonna have really long loading screens? Oh, I'm gonna hate that. I hope it doesn't have really long loading screens, like um, something like Portal 2 that has really long loading screens. But it's still worth playing because it's fun. Oh no. Yeah, this is taking a while. Maybe this is just for the very beginning, when you're first getting into the world or something like that. I also don't know if this is a uh, free roam. Fair warning. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that... I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it, and we think that's the whole world. The room. And the poster. The picture is something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie. What is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Oh. Hello? Okay, we're in. Anyone here? Yeah, I knew that was going to be sprinting. 
um, what's it called? I knew had to. I knew there was gonna be a hole in that poster thing that she was talking about. Base. Uh, so she's basically talking about. Uh, people get used to the room. Yeah, they're scared of the outside world because they're on, they don't know what's going on. What? Oh. Oh, I have to hold it. Prohibited items reminder. Ooh, this looks sweet. Certain objects are not allowed inside the bureau. Recent incidents have necess have necess necessitated an issued reminder on prohibited materials. Unauthorized weapons, pagers, laptops, smartwatches, smartphones, smart gaming devices, anything smart, number two pencils, any objects considered a a iconic representations of an archetypal concept. Rubber ducks, ketchup bottles. Oh, it is control. Is they're trying to control you would do make turn you into a slave or something? I don't know. What was that? I kind of want I want I kind of want this game to have uh some horror elements. Federal Bureau of Control. So do I get superpowers? For them and they were hiding in plain sight. I don't get it. It's a big fat building. In the middle of the road. Security order. A shark in his, although, ah, uh, whatever. Where do I go? Am I going the right Hello? direction? Hey, excuse me. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's oh, assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm a janitor. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they don't have a There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sound. I've done okay. enough okay. shift loaner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Wait, so I'm trying to get a job or something? Wait, I was just here. Oh, I just had to go around. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? So it is like a metaphor of her life. Courtney Hope. So this is it like uh, trying to break through reality or something? What's a show or a game where an agency fights monsters but then they hide it from the public? Let me think. Huh. I can't think of any. But there's a bunch I know, but not, nothing's coming to mind right now. Oh well. What? It, what? is going on ooh creepy levitation my gravity falls ooh wait that's one of them that was a that was space i saw some planet looking things and that looked like a nebula that was space that <coughs> that thing that was space Did I lose you there for a moment you know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau took him. Okay, let me see what my... What? Oh, options. Huh? Sprint. Shoot. A multi-launch melee use sees. Oh, no. Am I only gonna have guns then? Because it sounds like I'm gonna use guns instead. Oh man. But I'm gonna fight supernatural beings. 
Oh. Where is everybody? Do not disturb. Jesse Faden arrives at the oldest house, the headquarters of the Federal Bureau of Control, to look for answers to the mysteries of her childhood. Track. And non-official Barbara, I'm not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day for the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Trench. What? I thought that was me. I accidentally pressed the button. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? What? Who's talking to her? Is she insane? That'd be kind of sweet. Results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. So did I just like pick it up? Uh, it's like it holds memories or something. I pick it up or I touch it and I get the memories from that object. Hardcore parkour. Ugh, I hate that. And I'm dead. Great. I suck at platformers. Ooh, that's cool. The same gun. Oh, this place is like a tutorial thing. Okay. Now I have a gun. Do I have ammo? Infinite ammo. Sweet. What are these? There. Okay. Sweet. Oh, I thought that was a dodge button. Um, there's gotta be a dodge button, right? Yeah, I knew it. Those weird things had to do something. Something's coming. This threat. An attack. Duty is 
director. Keep the bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Sounds like everyone in a contest. Let's fight it down outside. Is it safe to go? Can't you see the hanging dead bodies right there? <gasps> okay, now you see them. You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. You. Thank you. That was. Horror. What? Oh, come on. Can I take cover? I mean, guess that's the grenade button for the future. Super strength. Hiss guard. Ooh, that's, those are some weird fumes. Secure line of communication. That guy's weird. Guy does. It's weird. Reach the hotline. What? Oh man. But the guy up up there is gonna turn into one. The hotline. Says the dead man. Ow. Oh, there. Ah, oh, crap. Love the destructible environment. That's sweet. Give me money. Reminder, oh. if you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One. Search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Two, carry the altered items of power. Three, wait for the hero staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Okay. So it's like a drill training. <clears throat> what did I get? Oh, I got materials. Can I upgrade my weapon or something? Ooh, I can get two guns. And I can mod them. Hmm, not bad. Multimedia? What? Oh. These are just recordings and stuff I'm getting. Service weapon. No unique procedures required when bound. The object allows... Par... Para... Paratilitarians to whatever. This object must only be bound by individuals seeking the role of I don't know. The object will determine whether you're worthy. If rejected, the applicant is terminated. This process is dictated by the weapon, though their criteria is unknown. Oh, that's what happened to the dude. He, uh, he wasn't worthy and got killed. Acquisition date? 1964? Damn. Excalibur for... Ver, uh, Verunastra, all weapons that blah 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 of their wielders if objects of power are the convergence of forces based on the collective subconscious, then it may be the original manifestation of that event. If this is the case, whatever. Yeah, that's kind of sweet. So much is expected from the director, the responsibility, the privilege. Zachariah Trench. Oh, that's who the guy trenches. What's that? Creepy. They're gonna come to life and kill me. I know that. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. <gasps> uh. 
Ah, oh, cool. Also, I love the character design. Something about- I'm, I'm not even gonna lie. Something about the character just makes it look not character-y and more human. It really makes it look human. Something about it. Maybe it's the eyes or the spacing of everything. It's weird. It's fascinating. Yay, no guys are gonna try to kill me. Wait. I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, I'm supposed to get out. Let's just proceed further. I have a map, right? Please say I have a map. Nope, I don't have a map. You do not have clearance. Oh! Those are like memory cards. That means I can finally get into that weird room. Oh, wait. No, I gotta go to the elevator. If I wanna go to that weird room. Um, the elevator is... I had no idea. This is towards the director's office. So I already went there. So, I have to go... Over here-ish? Can I shoot these? <gasps> oh, sweet! Ah, oh, that's so cool! I could just I could just stay around and start breaking everything. It's so destructible. It's awesome. Nah, but I gotta go forward. Oh, I love the physics. Yeah, creepy. Central executive. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Urban legend. Is your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. I think she may have multiple that personalities. Contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you plummet over and over. I can't see. I literally can't see. I can't see. Ah, oh, crap. I can only see their health bars. Uh oh. Crap. I have 1200 spikes though. I guess you could say that's a good thing. Ranger? Wait. Ranger, second class block. Dang it! I wasn't watching my health. Oh wait, I'm stupid. I could have gone to the enemies. Crap. Okay. Pay attention to your surroundings. You will sustain lethal damage if you fall too far. Yeah, fall damage. So does the, the entire game take place in just that one tower, or is that just the first level section? If that's true. It's gonna be. A, it's it's different. It's weird. I don't know if maybe the tower is detailed enough. I'd like it. So, where am I gonna be? Oh. Uh, Hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, it's our Can I duck? Check a duck. Yeah, uh, let me heal, let me heal. And I can't heal. Uh crap, I can't see with this filter of red. Damn it. Run, 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 heal. Oh, crap. Okay. 
Yay, I finally got one dude. That's good. Uh, oh, that's sweet. Just a dude inside of another dude. Big head. And little guy in the middle. Ooh, give me a key card. Help me fix it. I got a mod. Yes. Shatter projectile choke. Wait, what? Minus six percent. Oh, projectile spread. Is that bad? Oh, maybe it's like a. Um, the f I don't know. Wait, what? De I don't want to deconstruct it. Hmm. Order. Wait, what? I think I already have it equipped then. You do not have a clearance level. Wait, what? Oh. Maybe this isn't like. Oh, these are materials to create clearance stuff. Oh. Like those le those numbers are their like clearance level. And the, the materials are what they can make for that clearance, I think. Just fed and arrives at the oldest, blah blah blah. Guided into the building by the generality, Jesse finds Zachariah Trench, the director of the bureau, shot dead. She picks up the pistol next to the body and is translocated to the astral plane. A strange board encourages her to bind the gun, an object of power, called the service weapon. She succeeds, and the board informs her that she is now the director. Oh, she's the director now. Ooh. So cool. This just everything oh, shifting. Shit. You did it. We did it. Can she doesn't move me? her mouth though. Are you with us? No. With the bureau. No. Are you still sane? Ooh, outfits. I like the civilian one. Oh crap, it is. <gasps> oh, damn. Wait, I think it is only this uh, tower thing. Wait, if it's a tower, then why is it this? Actually, it may not be a tower, but at the beginning it looked like a tower. Anyway. I'm gonna go to the research and records. Urban legends. Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials but can also dictate the characteris characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as the modern ev evolution of Jung's archetypes. We recognize certain whatever informed by our blank and uh, unpopularized by our media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can even be artificially created in popular culture such as uh, using darkness. Our Bureau, myth our bureau, bureau made an anthology television program. Once the seeds are, so are sown, human imagination ex Excerbates the details. Certain paranatural phenomena contain clear elements of popularized folklore. AWEs that only occur on whatever. A pair of scissors that consume human whatever. I'm going to say human jugular. Through two punctures on the toes. These details living in the minds of so many have been given strength through belief. Urban legends are not just stories for children. They are uh, paranatural realities waiting to happen. So basically if you create an urban legend... And let's say a lot of people believe it, it'll become true at one point. Um, what about the what if you do that with rumors instead? Like, say you that'd be terrible or good. Marshall, we checked out the, sus the suspected AWE in Duluth, uh, wasn't anything just like the house fire before this, and the, mal and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of the duds. We need to find a better way to sort the fake the AWEs from the real things, or you need to rotate these field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're on route to Sherman Ranch. Next one on the list. Let's help it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Prohibited items. We already saw this one. Maybe these could be affected by the weird powers. Oh, this one's the one that's really messed up. Multimedia. 
What? Oh, never mind. We already saw this. Oh. Also, I think these right here are like live action. Wait, let me just look at it again. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. A side note. Remember to cover their connection to the astral plane as well. Now. Okay. I do have to say something about it. I'm pretty sure it may be live action, but something about it makes it look like it's not live action. So it may actually not be live action. It may just be fake. Uh, I mean, uh, it may just be uh, just they might be just using models for those things. Because I looked at it at the mouth and the lip syncing is off. Maybe it's just maybe it's something where you get someone that looks like the part, and then you get the person that actually is the voice. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. A side note. Yeah, it looks something. Everything looks off, and the voices are the voice is off by a few by a little bit, which makes it really weird. Doesn't. Like when something is off with the lip syncing, the voice doesn't seem to like it matches the actual character. But then when it works, you can see that it matches well. You just get an uneasy feeling that it doesn't match when it's not good lip syncing. It's just weird. Anyway, that'll be it for this part. We did a lot of cool stuff. We got a gun. That was really cool. <gasps> Dude, I got a photo mode. Okay. Yeah, the face looks strange. Strangely human and realistic. Anyway, that'll be it for this part. Goodbye.